As far as I'm aware, it's a life care centre that provides classes for young children and children with sort of like learning difficulties. We did the front reception room about three and a half years ago. Front reception all up the stairs and they obviously called us back to do another job so we obviously must have done something right the first time. I think it's about 100 square metres. Uh, thankfully most of the meterage is actually in this room so that's not too bad. We've got a small hallway, maybe about five or six square metres and then another side of this room. We had to sand the floor, scrape the floor and also give it a screed which the screed was about 45 bags. Slightly more than we anticipated but it's one of those things you spend a wee bit more money and get it done right the first time so we didn't have to uplift anything that was down here another i don't know who it was that uplifted it but when we came in it was all lifted and we spent maybe an hour an hour and a half two hours sanding it getting it all scraped and hoovered and then the screed took maybe two hours two and a half hours but again it can vary on the, the job if it was an uplift i think i was speaking to someone earlier on and they said that it was guys here lifting for over two weeks before we put the screen down, so thankfully, <laughs> thankfully that wasn't me that had to do that. So, well, I think originally it was carpet that was down here, foam back, and obviously carpet in commercial areas is good to an extent, but especially somewhere like this, where you've got young kids and everything running around as well, stuff's going to be getting spilt. Um, Tico's a lot easier to keep clean than carpet, and a lot harder wearing as well. You get your 25 year wear guarantee with it as well, so a lot more people are transitioning from carpet and carpet tiles into LVTs such as Amtico and Carndine, and also I think it looks better, easier to keep clean as I says, you just have to give it a quick mop, no hoovering or trying to bleach it to get stains out or anything like that. And it also handles temperatures as well as well, such as if it gets wet, if it's snowing outside or whatever, that's not an issue as long as you give it a mop up if there's pools of water lying for a prolonged amount of time. There was a slight challenge at the start. Um, there was a major height difference in this room. Uh, one half was about an inch higher than the other. So I think we had allowed for a certain amount of screed and it got to the end and I realised we didn't have enough screed to do that other room because we used so much in here. So it, it was, it's not knocked us back any longer. Um, we screeded that room yesterday and just cracked on in here. So I think it added on a wee bit extra to the cost with the screen, but apart from that, it's fairly plain sailing so far. I don't want to speak too soon, 